May you know today that you are not alone. May God so infill you with God's presence that even though you cannot see that presence with your physical eyes, you may feel that presence with your heart and with your entire soul. We pray today for you that even if you're a person that has lost family members and can no longer see them, that you have the active presence of God with you, and that you realize through that active presence you are not alone. May you also have the spiritual understanding today that gives you a spiritual glimpse that even though loved ones may no longer be with you, and you may be seemingly alone, you are not. That all that has happened is their souls have simply slipped out of the physical bodies that could no longer serve them, but they are still alive. And all those that you loved are still alive. And prayer is the language of spirit, and you can still send them blessings through prayer. And they will feel this on the other side of the veil of life. And as you walk ahead in full life, not feeling lonely, not feeling cast down, not feeling as if you're being punished, you are living your life the way they would want you to live life. You are fully engaged in living in the moment, being empowered by the presence of God, being filled with the love of God and having it surround you. And may it touch you at depth from center to circumference. May you feel the love of God. May this be a day like every day following in the future where you feel more of the presence, where you feel a commanding, wonderful feeling of God's love, of God's support, of God's guidance, of God's help in every moment of every day. And may it be a day where you are empowered to give this kind of love to others, and therefore through the love of God coming through you to others, you make a difference in their life. You soon find by reaching out to others that many are seemingly lonely. And it is a call to you when you feel loneliness to give of your love to others. And when you do so, you will soon find that you aren't lonely at all, that you have more friends and more support in human form than you've ever had. Because you are a friend to them first. May God use you. And may God help you to rid the world of loneliness. And may God empower you through God's love coming through you to be a brave person. Love is the prerogative of the brave. And to be the type of person that does not stand behind their own self imposed barriers, but the type of person that goes over those barriers to reach out to others. May you know today that others need you. May you know today that others are praying for you. And may you know that as you look around in your situation, your room seems vacant and lonely, that this is God's call for you to go beyond that room whether it's a self-imposed room of the mind or in the outer in your home, and to find those that need your presence and to associate and befriend them in God's love. May you feel the love of God. May you feel the presence of God. May it infill you with power and may it feel you, fill you with a, a knowingness that you are in the ever-abiding presence and help of God. I decree this for you in Jesus Christ's name. 
and it is so. Amen.